Sunny and Tavy here on behalf of Poetic City. We are coming to you live from the Paseo Arts District. We have an opportunity for artists looking to display their work or make a little money. We've been given the chance to um, hold a month long exhibition here in the Paseo for the month of February. We are looking for 10 artists, visual artists to display here. So that's anybody from sculptors, that's um, abstractionist, portrait artist. If you're a photographer and you'd like to display, mm -hmm. uh, we would like you to apply. So uh, Tavy's gonna tell you everything you need to do to, uh, to apply. What up everybody, like you said, my name is Bleak or Tavy. First off, I wanna thank the Paseo so much for this opportunity. This event is called Melanin Stories. We're here at the new creative creative space here in the Paseo. Man, this is a fabulous, beautiful, gorgeous gallery. You gotta come check it out. Now the Paseo has gifted us an opportunity to be able to share what we think is dope artwork. And what we wanna do with our opportunity is we wanna allow our people, our melanin skin people to be able to come show off their talents. Come be in a environment that might not be comfortable to you. All right, so this is what you gotta do to submit. First, you got to email poeticcity16 at gmail.com. In the subject line, you need to type in Melanin Stories Art Exhibit. That way we know what you're referencing to when you email us. All right, so you want to send us three to five good pictures of some of your art. Like she said, photography, uh, she said sculpting, pottery, um, paintings, just whatever your visual art is to submit, you need to send three to five paintings by December 1st. Yes. By December 1st, you need to have that submitted to Poetic City 16. And like I said, we're in the new creative space by the Paseo, y'all. It is beautiful here. You do not want to miss this opportunity. When we say melanin, we don't just mean black people. Yes, black people are melanin, but we mean, you know, Latinas. Uh, we mean uh, Dominican. We mean Native American. You know, we want to see a lot of different stories out the melanin people. We will be having the Melanin Stories art exhibit on the first Friday of February. Mm -hmm. Now, the dope thing about First Fridays in the Paseo is it's one of the biggest art walks in OKC. So that's why we say this is a great opportunity. All you have to do is just submit. Uh, there's a rental fee of $55, but you have the chance to make your money back plus some. Um, and your artwork will also be in the exhibit for the whole entire month. So we're giving a month for you to be able to sell your artwork. Do not hesitate on this. You used to come around to Paseo when you were 16 years old. Yes. Correct? Right, right. So I actually went to um, school right up the street from here. Um, so for four years, actually, I spent time here in the Paseo as a teenager. So just on a personal note, it means a lot to be able to, um, to display here. It's one of my all-time dream. Um, so to be able to do it at this level is, is great. And so I'm excited, you know, yes. to be able to do that and to, to bring some people along with me. So, yeah. And like I said, I mean, the goal for all this is uh, Poetic City definitely wants to uh, stand behind any movement where we're able to push our culture, get our people out there. And that's what we're trying to do here in Paseo. And Paseo is so grateful allowing us to use their platform to do so. Like I said, don't miss this opportunity. This is a way for us to help create change help people to get to see things and visuals that maybe will enlighten them on some issues of our past. So don't miss out on this opportunity.